Today we're going to take a look at creating clickable shortcut links to control that multi-monitor setup. And to do this, we're going to right click on a portion of the desktop and then we're going to go down to new and then we're going to go down to the secondary pop-up context menu and we're going to select shortcut and once we click that shortcut link it's going to open up a pop-up box that says what item would you like to create a shortcut for and then it's going to have a little entry field an input field that says type the location of the items well, we're just going to copy and paste because these, these system paths are a little bit long and hard to remember. So we're just going to copy and paste. So what we're going to do is we're going to put all of these folder paths, all of these link paths down in the video description so that you can just copy and paste them into the shortcut field. So the first one we're going to start with is primary monitor only. We're going to copy that shortcut and we're going to paste it into the location of the items field. And then we're going to select next. We're going to give it a unique name and you can name it whatever you want. We're going to name it primary monitor. And then we're going to click finish. And that's created a clickable shortcut link on our desktop. When we click that link, it will send the desktop to the primary monitor and terminate the video signal to the other monitors sending them into power saving mode. All right, so let's create one for a secondary monitor only. We'll do the same thing. We're going to right click on an empty portion of the desktop. We're going to hover over new and then we're going to click shortcut. We're going to copy the secondary monitor only, the external monitor link location. And we're going to paste that into the location field. We're going to click next. And then we're going to give it a unique name. We're just going to call it second monitor only because we have a dual monitor set up here. So this will let us know this is the second monitor. And there we go. We have a clickable shortcut link placed on our desktop. And when we click that second monitor only link, the system is going to send the desktop contents to the secondary monitor and terminate the video signal to the primary monitor sending it into power saving mode all right so let's make another one this one we're going to make is going to be for extending the desktop across to multiple monitors so we're going to do the same thing we're going to right click on an empty portion of the desktop select new and then shortcut and then we're going to copy and paste the link location for extending the monitors into that pop-up box we're going to click next and then we're going to give it a unique name we're just going to call it extend monitors and then we'll click finish and there we go we have another shortcut link on our desktop and when we click that particular link it's going to extend the desktop across both monitors so it's going to activate the video signal for both monitors and then extend the extend the desktop across both monitors and we'll create one more. We're going to do this one for cloning or duplicating. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to right click on an empty portion of the desktop. We're going to hover over new and select shortcut. And we're going to copy that link location for cloning the monitors. And we're going to paste that in there and press next. We're going to give it a name. We'll call it clone monitors. And then we're going to click finish. And there we go. We have a fourth shortcut link added to our desktop to clone the monitors to duplicate the desktop on both monitors. So that's basically going to send the video signal to both monitors and duplicate whatever's going on on the primary monitor. It's going to duplicate that on the other monitor. You can keep these links on your desktop or you could place them on the taskbar. You could just drag them and drop them onto the taskbar so that they're always in view there. And that way you don't have to fumble around with remembering hotkeys for now, just getting into that transition of utilizing this functionality. And you don't have to worry about remembering hotkeys or going into Windows settings. You can just click those graphical little icons on your taskbar. You could also, at a later date, add the Quick Launch toolbar to the taskbar. And then you could add them there as well. 
And that's pretty much it. This gives you a little bit additional functionality, a little bit quicker way of transitioning between those multiple monitors from within the software, from within the operating system. So hopefully this helps improve multi-monitor functionality on your system.